Hello everyone, I have a product from Home Craftology that I want to unbox with you today. It is a storage container for diamond painting or other kind of crafts if you want to put it, use it for it. That'll be fine too, but stay with me. We'll open it up in just a moment. I filmed the unboxing of this well at least I thought I filmed the unboxing of this <laughs> I opened it up and everything I had pressed record and for some reason I must not have pressed the record button hard enough guess what I lost I was halfway into the whole thing and so I'm boxed it back up I'm gonna reopen it for you so it'd be like when you get it at home <laughs> so bear with me I am trying to be legitimate and that way you can see and know what to expect when you get yours if you so choose to purchase this if you like this type of container system uh, or on the go would like to travel whatever this is right up the, your alley so yeah, so yes, I did unbox it already, but I am going to unbox it again on film this time for you. <laughs> so it does come nicely in the box that way. <laughs> I'm just having one of those days. I'm having a Monday on a Friday, y'all. Do y'all ever have a Monday on a Friday? I have a Monday on a Friday every day. It could be Wednesday, and I'm having a Monday on a Friday on a Wednesday. Yep. And so, yep, it comes with that resealable little thing. Sometimes you can use these for other things if you like to. I just throw them away because I have so much other stuff in here. It is nice, and, and this one is an, has the purple uh, around the zipper. It is black. It has two zippers on it, like luggage. I am opening it up for you and here you go it has its own stickers round ones for the lids for the lids and so it's 60 I do believe it's a 60 and the lids you can see how deep they are if you look at your thumb I hope that's a good enough like example how deep they are they are round you can see and they the lid screws off and I was kind of worried the reason I hadn't gotten the, these before because of the screw off lid because I thought well my gosh I'm gonna have to screw off but look well, every time that I changed my my diamonds, I didn't want to have to unscrew every time. But this comes off really quickly, really quick, and it it feels kind of tight. You just have to make sure you get it tight. It comes off really quick, so it wouldn't be a big deal. And it keeps them separate. It has a foam insert, as you can see. The foam insert you can see the light through it that's <laughs> really neat looking <laughs> and it goes on down in there also it has a little pocket up here a mesh pocket this is a diamond painting tray the diamond tray and it has space for your diamond painting pin right there it has a little set of goodies accessories to come with it oh. there is the funnel and I'll show it to you if I can get to the end there we go it's on this side I think you know how it is with somebody watching you you ain't gonna find it you're gonna struggle with it you see this one I've got the square ones already this is the round one and it would go perfectly in 
there. And you pour your diamonds in from their packets or however you, yours come. And it just folds right back up. It's a little silicone funnel. And even if you didn't use these for diamond painting, you could use them for all kinds of other things. Sometimes I don't have a funnel to put um, powder stuff in water like uh, plant food or um, hummingbird food in water and things like that. Sometimes I don't have that. So it also comes with more stickers. These are more rectangles, rectangle stickers right there. That would go good on the, if you want to put your stickers here labels okay another you get another diamond tray you get i'm gonna put that over there with that i'm gonna take a picture of it too because i'm gonna also put some pictures on amazon for and look how many diamond pins you get with the little diamond uh comfort grips and you get the different uh spacers here, I think that's a three, two or three spacer. This one looks like a four and this one looks like a six. And they all come with their metal tips, which I like the metal tips better. And these little comfort grips, you get three of those. Of course, you know, if you're into this hobby, you get a ton of those pink diamond <laughs> pins, but not many send you this with it or these with it. Some of them do, some of them don't. And here is a nice addition to this set is a straightener. A lot of people wonder, how do you get your rose straight? Now mine ain't all, nobody's told me that yet. I'm not really one to get them real straight. But <laughs> I, <laughs> I usually use one of these straightener tips. You see it a straightener tip on the other end okay um, but this gets a whole row a whole long row and that will help you do the edges and things like that and I you can it will actually fit in between and you can actually go up back and forth with it sometimes and straighten that row up and fix it so yeah it comes with all of these things this is the 60. Now, the, they have a 70 one. It's a little bigger. And I think there's only a dollar difference in it. So if you want more bigger, then go for that one. If you just want, you're okay with the 60 and you don't want something too bulky, go with the 60. But it's all gonna work. It's all looking, it's gonna look good. Um, I'm gonna use mine. For when I travel, okay, I want to use mine for when I travel and take my diamond paintings with me. Uh, I do a lot of hunting with my husband now, and that has gotten ripped, so I'm just going to put them in there like this, just like that, and whoops. Put these stickers in the back of it. And that's how it goes. Right there. Oh, I'm forgetting the funnel. Don't forget your funnel. And I love this because I was taking my other my I was gonna have to take my other containers and I just I didn't want it scratched up. It's one of the Elizabeth Warden ones or whatever you call it. And it's hard plastic and clear on top. And if it gets knocked around or whatever, it could break and crack and all this. But this is going to be a lot better. Whoops! It come out! <laughs> I leaned it forward while it was still open. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm not a very good demonstrator, I guess. But anyways, this is really nice. It's all padded. 
everything fits in just really good. It's, it doesn't take long to un, un, uh, to unscrew these. Um, and I, I think it, it's going to be a good thing. I really do. I'm, I'm looking forward to using it for whenever I go to our hunting place. We have hunting, uh, a hunting club about two hours from here. We take our camper down and we camp. While I'm there, I like to do something in my spare time. It, I don't, I, sometimes I have narcolepsy or, you know, where you, you just can't sleep very well. And I get sleepy by diamond painting and I took it down there last time. And I enjoyed taking it with me. It worked out really good. I didn't have this though. I'm so glad I have this now because I can pack it up and go and I'm, I don't have to worry about my diamonds getting cracked, uh, the container cracking or falling and all of the containers fall out. The other one, they're just kind of in there and if you take the top off, they could just fall or the, top, the, the lid could get crushed or, you know, I don't want that to happen to those. So this is going to be good for when I go off. I also have a little bit of a, it is the Home Craftology 60 grid diamond. Uh, Home Craftology 60 grids diamond painting drill storage case. Bead organizer, shock proof box with funnel and tray. It comes with all those little things I showed you. Uh, they have it in two colors, blue or, let me see. Well, it comes purple, I do believe. And the 70 grid is, let me see, it's pink, hot pink. So the 60 grid is the purple one, which is $25.99. This, the 70 grid, which is hot pink around the edge, you can see where the edge, where it's around the edge. It is $26.99. Uh, the 70 is hot pink. The 60 is purple. So I hope that you check this out. Uh, I think it's a great, great deal. Uh, the reason I have not gotten one of these yet is because I was worried that you would just have to I would be unscrewing lids over and over again and once I've seen it I see that it's not hard to unscrew them because they just unscrew really quick just make sure that it is on there tight you don't want to over tighten it to where it cracks the hard plastic of the container you know but this really is going to help me and if you like to travel and take it with you or if you like to put it away safely um, if it fits whatever you think you may need go ahead and get it it came very quick i didn't have to wait months for it to come from china uh, i'll put the link in the description below for where you can get it i have a bonus thing that i have ordered I want to do this because this is for me. This one is for me. I didn't want to get give these to my grandbabies. I get them plenty enough. I got this for me. Is there anything wrong? So just wait. So you see, some of y'all may recognize this character. I haven't grown up. Do you recognize this character already? I hope you do. Let me see. Everybody's going to these resyllables. <laughs> this is if you are used to watching Simon's cat, please let me know below in the comments. This is the little kitten. I've got I've got the the other Simon's cat, Simon, the Simon, Simon of Simon's cat. This is the little kitten with a little fluffy tail, complete. <laughs> I 
We don't talk about such things. Anyways, there, it even has the little claws. The little, I don't know if you can see it. Right there. Little claws. And these are actually, you can move these. They're Velcro. It's a little bird. A little boat. A little boat. A little birdie. Let's see if I can get it to focus in on this little birdie. The little boat. And a star. And they're all Velcro. And this was pre-order off of Simon Cat, Simon's Cat um, Instagram. When they ha when they offer these, they you pre-order them because they and then they make them. So they know how they know how many to make and send out. This was bought probably back. I I pre-ordered this a good while back. Um, I'm going to say probably early spring. That's how long it's took. It's October now, almost almost November. I can't believe it. Can you believe it? Almost November, almost Thanksgiving. No, we haven't Halloween. We don't celebrate Halloween here. Uh, it's almost Thanksgiving. And I can't believe it. I mean, it just seems like we just started spring, and we were getting that virus and all this stuff, and then now, here we are. It's October, about to be Thanksgiving month. So, it took a little while. I was getting worried about it, but I had that perception. I was worried about it yesterday and the day before. I was like, okay, I need to email them and see, or message them on Instagram, see if they have shipped these yet, because I may not have gotten mine. Well, guess what come in the mail today? <laughs> this is a little kitten. So, it's going to go beside my other one. And I'm just so pleased with it. It's so cute. It's complete with all the details. Details. Um, yeah. Isn't it cute? <laughs> Y'all have a good weekend. God bless you.